Science. All right, sir. What's the NATO reporting name of the MiG-15? Pop, pop, pop. Answer the question. Wait, what, wait, wait a second. I gotta Google something. <laughs> yeah, okay, this is funny. Welcome back, you lovely degenerates. God, it, it's been a while since I've said that. We got a Tumblr today, and a Tumblr coming out in like five days because I accidentally made a ton of Tumblr content. So yeah, anyways, uh, we'll uh, we'll be getting right into it after these quick little disclaimers. <laughs> okay, so, so like too many YouTubers and streamers get canned for the same crimes. It's just bigotry, scams, and being weird to fans. When's Markiplier gonna rob a bank? But, but, but this does give a very interesting thought. If Markiplier robbed a bank, would he get canceled? See, like, like th think about it. If no one gets harmed, the bank has insurance so no one loses any money, would we cheer him on or would we put him on the cross? Oh. Oh, 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 oh. I can't figure it out. I think I'd be pro Markiplier even more if he robbed a bank. Personally, I'm not saying to go rob a bank, of course. I I'm just saying Markiplier's approval rating would would go through the roof if he did that. <laughs> Redditor posting on subreddit called something like r slash car help. Hey, my muffler's on fire. Does anyone here know how to fix it? Subreddit admin. If you had read the rules before making a fucking fool of yourself, you would have known that that question of this nature belongs in r slash muffler repair. Do not waste my time again. DELETED! Wholesome doomer pilled simp falls for a small, weeby TikTok e-girl. What happens next will make you want to lift several cinder blocks with rope and pulleys and drop them on the back of your own head in a maneuver known as the cement guillotine. Spoiler alert, he pulls a Shinji in the hospital. You know, it's, it's kind of weird how no one ever comments on the absence of smells unprompted. The nose just isn't a topic of conversation unless it's urgent. Huh. Like, okay, like, think about it. It's dark in here. Normal, regular observation. Finally, some quiet. It's a relatable exclamation that breaks the quiet, you bastard. But stating, doesn't smell like anything in here, th that's just an absolutely deranged sentence. You kick this person out of the friend group. He's gone. Never being invited to bowling again. All right, so imagine if you were hanging out with your pals and you blurted out some shit like, it's fucking dumb how you can't just buy one shoe at a time. And, and one of your friends was like, Haha, hang on. And they wrote that down on a piece of paper and passed it to a stranger on the street and that stranger passed it to another. And then suddenly every single person in the entire city of Topeka, Kansas had read your stupid thought and the newspaper was like, local idiot wants to buy just one shoe. And every once in a while, some asshole will just come up to you on the street and hand you a single shoe and be like, is this you? Is this your fucking bread? I hate your fucking guts. You disgust me. And that's what it's like to have a popular post on Tumblr.com. So I started up Destiny 2 yesterday and burst into tears because I forgot I had set my Steam name to Reese's Penis Butter Cups. Instead of uh, censoring penis, the game went and did, well, it did this. It censored the butt in butter. This game is rated M. Look at you, Mr. Reese's Penis Butter Cups. <laughs> Having fun deep dishing those peanut butter cups, you sick fuck. It's, uh, it's so fucking funny that nuclear waste is such a contentious topic. Like, yeah, those, those damn nuclear advocates need to figure out somewhere reasonable to put that nuclear waste. For now, we'll be sticking with coal power because it puts the waste products safe and sound in our lungs where they can't hurt anybody. Okay, you would think I was kidding, but the air pollution fandom says some pretty incredible shit. Sorry, I realized I'm not done. Because by the way, yes, carbon emissions are less harmful than nuclear waste. Even our lungs! We're fucking doomed, man. I need feminism because when Jesus does a magic trick, it's a goddamn miracle. But when a woman does a magic trick, she gets burned at the stake. That's just fabulous. Okay, real, real, real quick. I mean, they, they did also kill Jesus. That, that was a pretty... 
a pretty significant thing that happened. Like, I understand where you're coming from here, but they very much did kill Jesus. Are you so happy? Good Friday. <laughs> okay, so on today's edition of We Need to Legally Require People to Google Words Before Using Them, there, there's a girl on TikTok doing a diet where she only eats Slavic food to connect with her ancestors. Get, get this. She's calling it an ethnic cleanse. My, my god, the Slavs have already had enough of that. <laughs> SCP object that sues you for libel if you write down anything in the documentation about it that hasn't been proven in a court of law. SCP object that allegedly sues you for libel if you write anything down in the documentation about it that has been proven in a court of law. Mm, gotta, gotta add those words in there, bud. <laughs> Come on, child safety lid, you, you know it's me. On a somehow related note, what does this tag mean? Hashtag Richard Nixon. So, for those of you who don't know, Richard Nixon once called in staff to help him open an allergy pill bottle. It was the childproof type of bottle with instructions saying press down while turning. The cap had teeth marks on it where Nixon had apparently tried to gnaw it open. God, emulators are f***ing great. I think the guy who invented them deserves some sloppy toppy. Hey. Hey, OP, what the f*** does this mean? Okay, let me, let me, let me spell it out for you. It means I'm gonna find the guy who made the first usable game emulator and I'm gonna suck him dry! <laughs> Drier than the goddamn Mojave. And that uh, just in in the in the tags, leave some for me. You're gay because you like men. Me, <laughs> I'm gay because I hate women. We are not the same. This uh, this seems to be what I've learned. Yowie versus Shonen. <sighs> Why? Why would you say something so controversial yet so brave? As if you don't understand, Yaoi is just boy love while Shonen is like, you know, Naruto and Sasuke. They both hated Sakura and they both kissed. Coincidence? I think not! Judy Hopps is a cop who leverages a stranger's felony tax evasion to get him to put his life in danger and work around the clock so that she could keep her job. She then presumably helps him cover up his crime to get him a job on the same police force. Judy Hopps, by the way, has some very nice feet, but we need to remember that she's still a cop. Which leads to this. Political correctness. First Amendment free speech. You shouldn't have called the Zootopia rabbit sexy. That's why we had to push you down like a dog. My god, I did it! I- I killed him! Angel on my shoulder. We're extremely fortunate. You shot him in the side of the head and you're wearing gloves. Place the gun in his hand and set the house ablaze. Officer Gojer's tragic suicide will be the perfect cover story. Devil on my shoulder. Gojer was always eating stuffing and spelt wheat and steel cut oats. Betty tastes real good on a spit with an apple in his mouth. Come on. I've seen the way you've looked at him. My Topa, a six foot nine double D smoke so hottie PS1 graphics anthro leopard girl in a lamp coat. You must put a baby in me, your highness, quickly! Hey, so, um, please take this in the most encouraging and constructive way possible. Replace the batteries in the <laughs> Replace the batteries in the carbon monoxide detectors in your home. Thank you. Stop everything! IKEA names have meanings! This changes everything. Okay, so, so... BuzzFeed apparently only just realized that they are languages other than English. These strange, indecipherable symbols on IKEA products are apparently actually Swedish, according to several noted academics who have spent decades studying IKEA. Your NFTs are actually, finally, totally worthless. New report from industry research finds that 95% of the once-hyped crypto assets have hit rock-bottom valuation. 
So while like 95% of NFTs are worthless and most of the most expensive ones are priced between $5 to $100, where they were once drawing millions of USD apiece. Not a moment too soon and fully deserved. And in conclusion, it's easy to say with hindsight that NFTs are a stupid scam, but you know, you gotta understand. It was also easy at the beginning to say that and, and throughout the middle too. So today I learned that mice are not simply female rats. They are different animals entirely via reddit.com. Come on, man. <laughs> the actual Reddit post. Hey, uh, can we add a rule that doesn't allow basic facts most four-year-olds know? <laughs> I didn't say it was groundbreaking, eh? Uh, today I learned that, alright? <laughs> this poor guy. I find myself suspecting actual women of being trans now. It's like culture war trauma or something. I actually had to pause this movie and look this actress up just to make sure she was actually female. Jesus Christ, man, it's just, ah. Uh. Culture war trauma, or you know, maybe you're just a fucking creep. I worked myself up into a cultural frenzy to the point where I must investigate random strangers I see on TV to figure out what their genitals look like. I'M THE ONE BEING NORMAL HERE! I, I honestly this would be somehow less creepy if they were doing it for sex reasons. I want a big titty goth girlfriend. Okay, bro, have fun talking about Invader Zim with a 31-year-old pharmacy tech. Okay, but... But this is like going, oh, you want lemonade? Have fun drinking sugar and lemons. Like, like, bro, I, I will. That's why I ordered the lemonade. Some f***er on Reddit. This. I was having a conversation with a co-worker, and I mentioned the Sisyphean nature of our work, and he said, I know, aren't we lucky? He elaborated about how Sisyphus was lucky to have his purpose made clear. Every day, he just had to roll the boulder up the hill. That one conversation has helped change my whole outlook on work for the better. Okay, you know, you know things are bad when workers are giving themselves Stockholm Syndrome to cope with having to do pointless work. I don't know how to tell you this, but Sisyphus is being punished, tortured even. Like, that's the whole point. That's, that's the story. He's being tormented and you're like, I know, aren't we lucky? Fucking soy. <laughs> I, I was at a tattoo convention today and I saw a guy with a Spider-Man tattoo, so I walked up and went, Oh, dude, is that Spider-Man? Badass! I love Spider-Man! And then looked out and realized I was wearing my shirt that says, I love Spider-Man! In big black letters. I'm a fucking parody of myself, man. Uh, guys, please, please stop calling me a cartoon character or an NPC or Wojak. I, I'm a real boy, I promise. I swear. Please. So something that will never not be funny to me in Death Note was the faces Light Yagami would make when no one was looking. Like if anyone caught him once, the jig was up. Motherfucker really stood there in front of everyone like this. <laughs> then I'll take a potato chip and eat it. I mean, if only someone stayed back and overheard him twerk on Al's grave screaming, What do you think of that, Al? That's right! I win! Good thing it's a deleted scene because uh, motherfucker would have been put down much quicker. I mean, people really act like the Death Note corrupted him. This crazy bastard was screaming he was a god in episode two. He saw a slippery slope and decided to grab a sled. Okay, but like in the first episode, he was whining about how the world was diseased and poisoned and it needed to be fixed by someone. He's the anime version of Walter White. He didn't just grab a sled, he crashed a race car down the slope the second it came into view. Keep in mind, Death Note wasn't a story about power corrupting mortals, it was a story about an absolute lunatic chimpanzee man who got that button you can press to kill someone for a million dollars and never get caught and decided, even though he never got the money and someone very definitely did die, to just mash that thing at terminal velocity like he was playing a Mario Party minigame for keeps. 
n- n- not to mention in the first episode, he got names of prisoners from Japan and the US, if I remember correctly. You know, two famously extremely flawed court systems. Like, Buddy made a list of possibly innocent people and slam dunked them all into hell. On literally day one, too. <laughs> Ryuk was even like, oh shit, I've never seen a human do this before, what the fuck? <laughs> even the demon, the Shinigami was like, bro, you got fucking issues. Judging by your laughter, you've already figured out that what you have is no ordinary notebook. But you're the first to have written this many names. Look at how many people you've killed in only five days. <sighs> I know that Data Expunged is supposed to be more serious than Redacted, but it never lands right for me because Expunged is just like an inherently funny word. Uh, Me expunging my data. Alright, okay, every time someone goes, um, well, this work depicts X, which seems kind of problematic. (laughs) Why was that the noise I made? Okay. Ugh. And said depiction of X is specifically that it is a bad thing being done by bad people. My blood pressure just goes up a little bit. Shout out to that one clickbait video from ages ago that argued that Beauty and Beast promotes toxic masculinity because Gaston is a misogynist. Like, buddy. Friend. Pal. <laughs> that's, that's the point. I'll, uh, I'll never understand how a story is supposed to explore the problem without, like, you know touching the problem. This goes the other way when a universe is written to be quite literally somewhere where you would never want to go, and people are like, oh, that's so badass, let's all go there, oh, we want, we want the future to be like this, oh man. Starfield, general discussion, topic details, this game is a warning. If you let the liberals stay in power, then the future of mankind will look like Starfield. If you want the future of mankind to look more like the Imperium of Man from Warhammer, then stop voting blue. So, okay. I really hope that when Space Marine 2 comes out, they let you choose Titus' pronouns just to fuck with this guy specifically. People like this are convinced they'd be a Space Marine instead of a factory slave making one specific type of rivet until dying of miners long at 25. If you read any of the books, even fucking Necromunda, all right, like, like any of them. And your takeaway is, God, I want to live there. Please get yourself checked out. Because I believe you were tied at terminal velocity as a small child against a wall. Julius Caesar's assassination was the last time everyone in the group project did their part. So, you know, apart from the fact that 60 people agreed to stab him and he only had 23 stab wounds. So, yeah, that, uh, that sounds about right. You can go and read an Am I the Asshole with the title, Am I the Asshole for Kicking a Baby? And like, by the end, you'll say, Not the Asshole with your full chest. Meanwhile, some guy posts, Am I the Asshole for just wanting to play some video games? And he's like, just literally abusing his girlfriend. I just found my new favorite Kickstarter scam. It becomes more efficient by switching to the triangle. Energy power bank. No power source needed for one and a half years. Uninterrupted power on the go. Enjoy one and a half years of freedom with a charge-free Pen Energy Power Bank. Pen Energy Power Bank. That does not need to be recharged for 1.5 years. Uh, today I will introduce you to the new innovative Pen Energy Power Bank that does not need to be recharged for 1.5 years. The Triangle. The alternating current produced in the generator enters the electric PCB board and is stabilized. There, it becomes more efficient by switching to the triangle! The alternating current, AC, produced in the generator is being rectified into direct current through the PCB. There, it becomes more efficient by switching to the triangle! What? The triangle. It becomes more efficient by switching to the triangle. Hey guys, did you know it becomes more efficient by switching to the triangle? This inquiry is contingent upon two factors. Firstly, it is relied on the breakdown of the chemical structure of the triangle. It becomes more efficient by switching the triangle. Hey guys, 
Did you know it becomes more efficient by switching to the triangle? Did you know that? I bet you didn't. I bet you didn't know it becomes more efficient by- I'm losing my fucking mind. Hey, welcome to the outro announcement. I'm, I'm doing an October 32nd stream tonight. Uh, we're doing the Minecraft Create mod. It'll, uh, it'll be probably fun, I, I hope. Uh, maybe some horror games. We'll see. I I'm also doing this on the main channel, not my second channel. Second announcement, I got channel memberships now. You can support me directly and get access to emotes to spam in chat and in the comments. And I'll have future benefits later on. So that'll be cool. Um, yeah. It's that, that's the end of the video. Be sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment. Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say because it's the outro. Anyways, I'll see you all next time.